Wow, Ivan Banjo Fontanes, what an important, important interview. It came off the heels of the George Floyd. Um, that's why in the beginning of the episode, you see some of the footage that I actually took of protests in my neighborhood that were going on during that time. Uh, I had to put it in there as well. And um, I also had to speak to Yvonne because Yvonne is an activist, a political activist musician who actually lives in Minnesota. And my homegirl Elba Calado, uh, who's into, you know, production and knows that I'm that I'm doing the podcast, was like, yo, reach out to my man because I think it'll be perfect for you to talk about that on the podcast. So I reached out to Yvonne. Uh, he was more than willing to let us to, to get on the podcast and let us know what he was witnessing and he was there firsthand firsthand this isn't you know conspiracy theories this isn't like oh i don't i don't like cnn they're biased i don't like fox they're biased i don't like nbc they're biased no this is angel of words entertainment youtube channel we got this guy on the channel that had his boots on the ground that was there throughout the whole civil unrest and knew what he was talking about and knew what he was seeing and is in and is a political activist so he was going to give me the real deal on what was going on so we spoke about the music that they were playing while they, while the protest was going on he's the one we actually cracked this the the, the information that george floyd and Derek Chauvin, the general, the guy that uh, murdered him, the cop that murdered him, that he's the one that told us the world, you know, we cracked that story, you know what I mean? I don't want to, like, pat myself on the shoulder, but, you know, obviously we're not as popular as other networks, but uh, he actually is the one that told us that, you know, they had a relationship prior to, to, um, to, um, uh, this happening and they may have this murder may have taken place because there was some envy going on there so we speak on that and then we also move into puerto rican politics because this man is a master at puerto rican politics you know even though he called he's you no know, he called he says that he's not a politician on the podcast but he knows you know he knows a lot about what goes on over there and you know what he's talking about so it's a very if you're a puerto rican or and if you're a latino or even if you're a person that just wants to educate yourself on what why puerto rico isn't an independent nation you need to watch this podcast because we will put you on to some of uh, the idiosyncrasies behind puerto rico so catch that one ivan banjo fontanes on deck episode 21